Hello everyone. Today I'm going to show how to install a uh, the roof rail system on a 2018 Chrysler Pacifica. Got the parts uh, from the local Chrysler dealer. The uh, Mopar roof rails. All right. I got the the uh, roof rail instruction guide here. First step says to remove the uh, existing uh, plastic covers. So let's do that. Okay, so this is the first uh, plastic piece that I'm going to remove and I want to use a plastic tool to remove this so I'm going to use this toothbrush. So uh, this is the... Uh, I already removed the other side um, and this piece ended up breaking so um, you don't really need to use it again so it's pretty much just trash so this one might also break. So here we go. Alright, got it started. There's just these one-way clips on this thing, so you just kind of have to pull it off. Almost there. Get a little more leverage here. Okay. <sighs> Got it off, and yep, a couple of the clips broke. Um, that's how it goes. Alright, as you can see, this clip broke right off. Uh, this one chipped. Yeah, that broke. So pretty much all the clips on this guy broke. Um, but that's okay, because it's, uh, not going to be used again. Okay, now we're going to remove this rail here. Um, this uh, was a little bit easier. You just kind of have to put pressure where the clips are. Let me get closer. Yeah, this one comes up a little easier. Just kind of. All right, so after you get that main uh, cover rail off, there you're going to be left with eight of these clips. And uh, the best way to remove them is just to pull straight up with uh, some needle, needle nose pliers. There we go. Okay, now we're done with step two, remove the plastic pieces. Now step three, clean and remove uh, all surfaces and remove the plastic clips. Okay, we got all the clips gone. Now we're gonna clean it up. Get it all dry. All right, now it's clean and the clips are removed. All right, steps four and five are to put on the um, front and rear uh, protective trim. Okay, here's the rear trim. I'm going to snap this on. Uh, it's pretty obvious which, which side is which. So we're just going to line it up. And then once, this, once the uh, screws are lined up with the uh, clip holes, then you just kind of gently press it in. And it'll snap into place. All right, now is the uh, front piece of trim. Now this, this, there's one of them that's labeled left hand, and that goes on right above the driver's side of the car. All right, now with this piece, there is a, um, there's a front uh, cover piece here, and that needs to go in the in the very front. So I'm gonna snap this into place. You just line up the clips and press in. Simple. All right, now we're on to step six, which is to place the rail uh, over the uh, the screw holes, the mounting studs, I should call them. Now, 
Uh, now the rails are labeled left hand front. Pretty obvious this is going to go above the driver's side with uh, the side in the front. I'm just going to gently tighten them down with the screwdriver to start them. Okay, we got step six done. The rail is placed on the mounting studs. Step seven, now this requires a torque wrench with 3.6 foot-pounds of torque. So uh, I don't have a torque wrench, and I also don't have this star bit. So I'm going to go to AutoZone and see if I can borrow or loan these tools. All right, I just went to my local AutoZone and they lent, lent me this with the correct bit. And I uh, just got them all tightened down. Okay, step eight is put on the, uh, the um, protective trim covering trim so we're going to do eight first and then nine and ten the front and rear pieces all right these are pretty easy they just snap into place there we go all right we're going to do the right hand front uh, and these are labeled so look for the rh for right hand and then you can just kind of figure out which one's front and back so this one snaps in, all right, and the right hand and rear. And there you have it, finished installation of the uh, roof, rails, and crossbars for the 2018 Chrysler Pacifica.